I think it's easily the worst feeling in the world. Worst day of my life. Um, it's not much more to be said. Do you have one thing or two things on your mind that you that, that you'll leave and go home tonight thinking about? Okay. First and foremost, that's the only thing I'll be thinking about for a while. Almost 20 minutes left to play. Here comes a blitz on Burrow. They're giving chase, and he somehow... Time for me to take over. Turbo shot! Caught by C.J. Uzama. Now escapes again. And now throws late on the run. Got it! Justin Jefferson! Joe Burrow, Heisman Trophy winner. Does this look like a Heisman Trophy winner? Right, it does. Show, show it to him. Show, show everybody. What would you tell this kid right now? He looks like a national champion. I'm Joe Burrow. I'm doing Ice Bucket Challenge for ALS Awareness, and I challenge Coach Urban Meyer. <laughs> <laughs> He's to the 35, down to the 25. The Bengals beat the all-out blitz. I mean, so when I was transferring from Ohio State, I was third on the depth chart as a junior, coming off a broken hand, a broken throwing hand, and not a lot of people really wanted anything to do with me. People, I mean, people like Alabama were calling and wanted me to be their third-string quarterback, and I was like, me? Like, you guys, you guys must not know about me yet. Burrow has to hang in there and just get this ball out. That's what I'm talking about. Give zero me. And, and, but he said, he goes, he took that shot and everybody in the stadium all looked back at the referee to see whether or not he was going to throw the flag or not. And I, I may mess up the quote a little bit, so forgive me, but basically Joe Burrow got up, saw there was no flag, didn't complain, didn't do one of those. He turned back to Graham or Malik Jackson or one of them, and he said, you know, when I'm the GOAT, I'm going to get that call. And everybody on their defense was like, I like this guy. He just took wow. that shot, didn't complain, and said, you know what? I'm still a rookie. I'm not going to get that call. But one day when I'm the GOAT, I'm going to get that one. I was like. He just he doesn't. He, that energy just pours out. Put it in my hands. Let's put it in my hands, Trey. It's over. Let's put it in my hand. It's over. Hey, Joe, I got a question for you. What's your favorite nickname out of all of them that you got? Joe Shiesty. <laughs> Joe Shiesty. Like Joe Shiesty. Give us a minute. Give us a minute. So I eat a, a caramel apple sucker before every game on the bus, and then I always wear one sock inside out and the other one right side in. So those are the two kind of weird things that I do. <laughs> Hey, I learned from the last couple of weeks. Y'all ain't hitting me any, no more. I, I really like caramel apple suckers. And one, and, and one time, um, one of my socks was inside out and the other one was right side in. I forgot about it. I put it on and just kind of became a thing for me. You've been doing good, but remember, if you're going down, just go down. Yeah, I'm still learning how to do that. I see that. So my senior year, I got asked to prom with like 10 bags of caramel apple suckers. I'm still kind of going through those. And then my mom always gets me, gets me a bag for Christmas. So I have, have a lot of bags of caramel apple suckers. Once you get blown up one time, you don't get your Hey, you saw the one last week from, yeah, 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 I yeah. I'm learning, I'm learning. We'd like to keep you around for a while. Yeah, me too. You know after this, they're gonna get unlimited bags now because these Tiger fans want you to win. That's an NCAA violation right there. Well, <laughs> they just happen to go. <laughs> <laughs> it's good, baby. Undefeated on the coin tosses. Four and zero. Yeah, you know I've got a lot of Kevin Bacon before, um, Macaulay Culkin, Home Alone. That's a popular one. Those are the two main ones. I don't, I don't see it personally, but a lot of other people do. Hey, we know what kind of game it's going to be. We're going to have to score. We're going to have to score. Let's take the field with some intensity. Let's go. The comedian, uh, Brewer. Yeah. See, I never really knew that guy, so I was never really big on that comparison. Drops back to throw, scrambling to the right, being chased toward the sideline. No! See that? Oh, 
that big blue thing back there? Do me that. Don't do me that. That big blue. Don't do me that. Don't do me that. That's an insult. <laughs> So you couldn't overthrow me? You couldn't give me a stride overthrow me? My guy, you were wide open. <laughs> Going deep. Jamar Chase. He's got it. Chase to the end zone. Target is Chase at the 40. Look at that move. Everyone knows that mean. You know, F it. Jamar's down there somewhere. I'm gonna <laughs> just throw it up to him. He's gonna make a play. Look at Chase go! Oh my goodness, what a gear he just found! Chase for the touchdown! Burrow looking deep for Chase and Chase makes the adjustment and Chase will walk in. Thank you. I thought he was dropping everything. <laughs> um, definitely has played a big part in getting me the award. He played a big part with getting me here today, honestly. Um, so, you know what I mean? I can ask him nothing from Joe, you know what I'm saying? I just, I do whatever you tell me to do, because man, he's a god to me, you know what I'm saying? So, he's like a big brother, you know, I respect him with everything, I can show you respect him, but you know, uh, you know, whatever you say, I'm, I'm doing a good thing. Hey, hey Vaughn. Hey, Vaughn. They're definitely real. I think <laughs> I make too much money to have fake ones, so, you know, these are real. <laughs> Uh, I'm sorry, what was the second question? <laughs> it was, it was. Joe, nice to meet you, brother. Is there a significance to the glasses? Oh, no. Uh, I just think they're pretty cool. What do you think? <laughs> sunglasses? No, I wouldn't call them sunglasses. What up, Aaron? Hey, Eric. I'm Joe. Nice to meet you, brother. I love watching you grow up. Uh, first and foremost, I'd like to thank all the people that helped me throughout my entire process. Physical therapists, Nick and Aaron, my trainer, Dak, uh, my family obviously helped me after surgery. It was tough getting around the house. Uh, and then, you know, my teammates, I obviously wouldn't be here without them. Coaches, organization, everybody. So thanks, everybody, so much. Worked really hard to get here. Excited for this weekend.